fighting for Queen and country. Hi, Phil. How are you, Mark? You all right, buddy? Really well. Great to have you on the show. Uh, listen, Phil, a very sad occasion on Monday. Have you got plans? I am going to try and head into the capital myself on Monday at some stage, I hope. Um, just what time, where, how far I'll be able to get, I don't really know at the moment. I know it's going to be a lot of people trying to get a lot of people trying to get into town and pay their respects, but I very much hope to get somewhere a little bit closer than Southampton. Um, Phil, you've served in the armed forces with distinction, with courage and with expertise. Uh, to what extent were you doing it for the Queen? You sign an oath of allegiance to the Queen on the very first... One of the very first things you do is sign the oath of allegiance. And it's not something that you do and just forget about. It's it's taken very seriously. It's, um, you know, it, it, you've only got to look at what's going on right now and the part that the military are playing within what's going on right now to see exactly how the military and the royal family dovetail together. Indeed. And of course, that's the point, isn't it? Uh, she held the country together and she was the figurehead of our armed forces. Uh, what are your thoughts about King Charles taking the reins? Uh, will he inspire loyalty and courage in those serving this country in the military? Yeah, I think he will. I think, you know, it's, it's, it's a tough job. Obviously, his mother has had the reins for such a long period of time. We've all got used to him as Prince Charles. Now he's King Charles. There's going to be a lot of changes from the, the buttons on your jacket to the crowns on your head to, to all sorts. And I think, you know, it will take a little bit of time to get used to. But in terms of the fact that he is now the boss, he is the boss, and he's not there by default. He's there because that's rightfully where he deserves to be. And as far as the armed forces are concerned, I would imagine it's just a case of, right, crack on, fellas. You know, 